Hello and welcome back to Baldi's Gate 3. I feel I can't help but feel a little bit guilty about playing this game. Whoa. What is that? It's a big old squid arm. Um, it's very rare that I like uh you know, dare I say a triple A game comes out that might actually appeal to um my kind of niche audience. So it feels it feels uh, selfish for me to to partake in something that is as uh, robust as this. But what she got? She got a D twenty. Oh, uh, I didn't realize what was happening. Wake her. Reach for the artifact. Yeah, reach for it. Oops. <laughs> I, I like how rarely my character uh i wanted to see if you'd anything worth taking that's honest of you don't do it again i'll give you a pass this time considering i owe you my life and speaking of how are we alive i mean i really don't think it bears mentioning but the voice acting in this game is fantastic I was hoping you might know that. I remember the ship. I remember falling. Then nothing. Uh, do you have any idea where we are? No. I don't recognize this place. But anything's an improvement on where we just came from. I have no memory of this place. Aren't you a cleric? Uh, yo, but aren't you a cleric, though? We you want to stay together? What happened to our gith friend? You want to stay together, I take it. We need each other. And we both know what's at stake. Can't think of better company. Alright. Let's get moving. I'm gonna... I'll have... I'll have Shadowheart join me and you know it it makes sense I don't want to be um first of all I don't want to be a capital G gamer about this I'm like oh I only want the the uh, partners that I've like you know I have on my on my checklist here um we just got out of a horrible traumatic event and it seems like a good idea to stick together yeah I do want to, to uh get to I, and again I'm never going to remember her name but the Githyanki on on our team that is definitely on the task list, but you know, for now, why, why not uh, work together? Ruffle some Blackheart hat. Ooh, ooh, I do like a Blackheart hat. Can we wear that? Every item has a context menu where you may use it. I like how unobtrusive the the uh, tutorial is in this. Oh heck yeah, bud! Now we're rocking. Now we part of rocking. Wonder how many people have taken that hat. Probably everyone, huh? Recipe unlocked. Suspension of murgrass. A dead fisher. We got some gold. An intellect devourer. I do recall that the spaceship introduction, like, uh, it was a lot longer when I uh, I did it with uh, Peter. Perfumed letter. I remember this. Let's go ahead and give it a read. I love you. There I said it. And if you meet me tomorrow, I'll say it again and again and keep on saying it till we're old and gray. So let's do it. Let's go to Baldur's Gate. I know it's risky, but so staying here. The last few months have been hard, but they're always a little easier when you're there. Leave your boat and meet me at the hill overlooking the old bridge. Bring whatever you can carry. We'll make do without the rest. Don't be late. Love, Anna. Give me that murgrass. Oi. Can read books and notes. I believe I already did read it. Oh, we got some fish. There's bound to be a settlement somewhere along this river. 
I'm just taking everything. And we row with spray upon our necks, and we row with the spray upon our backs, and we all row with the sea beneath our feet, and the bitch queen stays the storm. Wave mother, wave mother. We got a, we got a sea shanty here. A little, little, little she, 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 she shanty, you know? Got some water. That seems like a good idea. Grab that water. Abducted commoner. Things are getting a little bit more alien over here. We got a dagger. Um, it does tell me like the value of things. Oh, do we have a combat over here? Doesn't seem like we're on like bad terms with the intellect of ours. Although I'm sure if I chase them down. Oh, yeah. There we go. They do be dashing over here. Look at them dash. They, it's less a dash and more of a scuttle. They, 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 they're more like scuttlers, you know? Wow. She doesn't hold back. Oh, they saved. Um, do we... We have a main hand attack, but I don't think we have a, uh... We don't have the Githyanki, um... Smack him with the pommel attack. Protect the creature from attacks. Increase its armor class by two until long rest. This is a level one spell slot. I would prefer not to waste it. Um, this is fire. We don't really want... Let's, like, block them and then maybe we can, like, push them in the fire. We could also, like, move over here and try and push them into the fire. Um, shove. Uh, I think that, that'll work. I feel like I want to be a little bit... Uh, it's hard to, hard to aim these things, actually. Perfect. Shove! Yeah, there we go. Now it's in the fire. And we'll go ahead and do a sacred flame on them as well. There we go. Did some good old environmental damage there. And they died from it too. Claws on Shadowheart. They did... Oh, wow. Wow, that's a lot of damage. Ouchie. We have uh, shared... Um, shared initiative. I, I kind of want to heal... Scroll of Revivify. We have a Potion of Healing. Let's use a Potion of Healing. Let's go ahead and do... Oh, that's... I've already used my bonus action. Okay, we're just going to do a main hand. Unless... Is this a... Evocation Cantrip. Oh, it's a Cantrip. Okay, we'll do that, but that's a ranged attack, so we're just going to go ahead and do a melee for now. Smacko. Oh, we did a crit hit. Didn't kill them, though. All right, we're going to use our bonus action as well, and we're going to try and uh, kill uh, this lad here. Nice. Can't move away because uh, this devourer will um, get an attack of opportunity. Although I have learned that sometimes that's not a bad thing. It's not a terrible thing to take an attack of opportunity, but we're just going to go ahead and leave it. Ooh, he's dying, though. Okay, so he is dying. We're gonna have to do something. Um, healing word on my lad here. So he's back up. And we apparently, that is a cantrip. No, it's a level one spell, but it's a bonus action. So we can heal and also attack. Smacko. And we'll attack. Oh, we don't have enough. Action points? Do we not have a... Let's switch to our melee. There we go. What do you mean we don't, don't have enough action points? I guess I'll just... Let's do a healing word on myself. I guess uh, I had to, like, get up or something, and um, it kind of counted as an action. There you go. It being this early in the game, I, I definitely want to um, 
get as much XP as I can and make use of our resources. Oh, that's right. And, you know, I, it hadn't even occurred to me that there are going to be traps. Oil of diminu diminution? Diminution? Coat your weapon in oil and it receives a negative one penalty to damage, but targets failing a constitution save suffer disadvantage on strength checks and save. Void bulb, one damage. Throw this alien bulb at a target and possibly pull in nearby objects and creatures. That's fun. Oh, we don't want to do that. We don't want to do that, actually. We don't want to do that! Wow, you really can't cancel something once you've started doing it, huh? We're standing in fire currently. Open the rest menu. I guess we want to take... Oh, we're downed. Okay, open the rest menu. Where is the rest? Oh, there it is. Camping and rest menu. Let's go ahead and do this short rest. We can take a long rest, but we don't have all that many supplies. So let's just do a short rest. Warlocks restore their spell slots. Oof. Really got to watch out what you click on. Not proficient with martial weapons or rapiers. But still, it's worth... Taking. As I say, I'm going to be kind of um, hoardy for a little bit um, until I've. Uh... Oh, yes, Thieves' Tools. That's nice. And we have one for Shadowheart. Send to Shadowheart. And we'll take these tongs. Why not? I don't know what they do, but we'll take them. We got some more recipe unlocks sublimate of belladonna. You can craft your own potions, poisons, and elixirs using alchemy. Gather ingredients to distill into to extracts and experiment to brew wondrous solutions. We, um, I don't know when we can do that. I don't know if we probably need like an alchemy kit or something. Actually, I. The, so this is like a fairly open area and I do know of like the one dungeon in this area I'm not going that direction just yet because I want to kind of explore other avenues and see something fresh I am just holding down the alt button you have to forgive me for that seems we could go down there can't get there you have to jump okay let's jump down there That was kind of fun. Nature's deep grooves in the mud around that rock. Can't be added, but we can move it. Can we move it? Or oh, maybe Shadowheart can move it. Target is too far. We have to be like right up against it. Can't throw too heavy. Can we like attack it? I don't think so. Okay, well we know that there's something there. Um, we'll come back to it. Maybe I can put a marker there. Um, strange rock. So someone's calling up to us up here. Jumping is actually quite powerful in this game. Uh, even in the couple of combats I did outside of the introduction, it you could get like a lot of verticality very, very quickly. It's Astarion. Uh, kill it yourself. You look capable enough. Ah, 
That's fun. Um, we have a not terrible strength check. Plus two strength. Nice. I saw you on the ship, strutting about whilst I was trapped in that pot. What did you and those tentacle freaks do to me? <laughs> you have it backwards. They snatched me up too. Mine flares worm and connected us you know i just I, I didn't realize this uh the first time i rolled through this intro but like when you think about it the mind flayer worm really kind of sidesteps one of the biggest uh difficult plot holes of D, D in the first place is why are you and your party members traveling together generally speaking every single adventure or campaign starts with your players like meeting each other in a tavern and there's generally speaking never like any reason why they should be traveling together they should be adventuring together because everyone makes a very different kind of character and they generally don't like each other um that's a lot of generalities sorry about that but all i'm saying is that the mind flare worm kind of gets around all of that by just like oh okay we're actually kind of on the same page even if we're not like you know uh similarly aligned it's the mind flayer's worm it connected us. Of course. That explains things in some way. And to think. I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> apologies. Um yeah, apology accepted. Might have done the same were the roles reversed. <laughs> A kindred spirit. My name. A starian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Introduce yourself. Tell them your name. I'll just introduce myself. A pleasure. So, do you know anything about these worms? Uh, yes, unfortunately. They'll turn us into mind flayers. Turn us into... Turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? Although it hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. Control it, we need to get rid of it. Well, yes, of course. But first things first. You should travel with me, our odds are better together. Yeah, sure, we can do that for now. You know, I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd isn't such a bad idea. And you seem like a useful person to know. Hmm. I accept. Lead on. Again, it's good to start. Oh, is everyone leveled up? Uh, we'll have to do a long rest in order to level up, I think. Your party is shown on the side of your screen. We're good. Wonder if there's another combat over here. I don't see the mind flare. Oh, it's trapped under something. You approach the dying monster. This is the thing that abducted you. You could end its life here and now. If only you didn't feel compassion. Compassion. No, you should be furious, shouldn't you? Shame. It's 
possessing your mind, forcing you to love it, but then the feeling slips. The creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere. I'm not so good at intelligence. Take advantage of the lapse, break free. Close those eyes forever. Oof. Monster. Death is too good for it. A bit of a, a bit of a dark end for them. Wondering if, if there's anything else over here. Um, there's some fire in this direction. I think that's the direction of the, uh, the dungeon I did. Oh, we got some goblins. What the heck is that? Goblin scimitar. What is a Asterion? Is a rogue. It wouldn't be a bad idea to have a rogue on our team. Supply pack. Perfect. What is this? Approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. It looks slightly dangerous. Yeah, touch the sigil, why not? That's why not. Oh. Um, uh, let's let flow some words of prayer to soothe the sigil's magic. Nice. Whatever you're doing is working wonders. Now a quick little pull should do the trick. At introductions, at magic. Say, but I know you, don't I? In a manner of speaking, you were on the North Lloyd as well. Uh, I was, yes. I can only assume you two were on the receiving end of a rather unwelcome insertion in the ocular region. Couldn't have phrased it more repellently myself. <laughs> known as ceramorphosis and let me assure you it is to be avoided you don't happen to be a cleric by any chance do you a doctor a surgeon uncannily adroit with a knitting needle ah uh, well i am a cleric you seem to know enough about our condition to realize it's beyond most cleric skills most no doubt but i find myself hoping to be in the presence of the few you don't happen to be one of them. Uh, I'm a cleric indeed, but I'm afraid the power to remove this parasite eludes me and I can't cure us. As we've established, few enough can. It's not exactly a common affliction. We're most certainly going to need a healer, and soon, too. How about we lend each other a helping hand once more and look for a healer together? Sounds like a plan. And like I say, uh, we are now have three party members. <laughs> Three party members that I didn't agree to. <laughs> I think you're about to embark on a journey with most ill mannered a man. Thank you for pulling me out of that stone. It's an act of foresighted kindness. 
kindness, I assure you. I have a feeling ample opportunities will present themselves for me to return the favor. Uh, we're going to talk about how he got in the stone. The Wizard of Waterdeep. So I believe this is a fast travel point. Do we have a second one? I don't think we do. You'll be able to teleport to this location by selecting it on your map. Yeah, so, uh, you know, I don't know what to tell you. Um, when I uh, get a, find a party member that I said I was going to take in the beginning, then I'll switch someone out. And I think that works well. I mean, like, you know, uh, not unlike a D&D campaign, NPCs come and go. That's been true for me anyway. Um, all right, so we have choices, lots of choices. Like I say, this is a pretty, pretty open area and you can go wherever you want. You'll have to forgive me swiveling around. I'm just trying to figure things out. Uh, so this is our dungeon. I do remember this. It's it's a really nice kind of classic design. Adam Driver. Uh, persuasion, that ship is full of monsters. I wouldn't go near it. Intimidation, the only thing you own is your life. Leave before I take that too. Let's do, I mean no harm, I'm just looking around. First you look, then you touch, then you take. The only thing we are sharing with you is our pointy ends. Get him! Oh, okay. Wow. Ouch! Well, he missed, actually. But I did take quite a lot of damage, nonetheless. Okay, let's see what um, Astarian can do. He can hide. Um, sneak attack is usually good. Oh, sneak attack ranged. Can we do that now? He must have advantage against the target. So if I go, like, here and hide... Uh, how does one hide? Oh, there we go. Hide. And then, like... Can we go, like, here? No, we'll just, we'll just stay here for now and, and keep, keep hidden. Oh, no. He Ouch! Wow, uh, I need to stop bleeding with Tav. He's not really a tank. Ouch. Is, uh, is Asterion still hidden? Gale is asleep. Um, Shadowheart is dazed. It's not going well, is it? Firebolt, concussion, concussive smash. Possibly daze your target. They can't take reactions and are easier to hit. Sure, let's do that. Oh, wait, that's only 55 to hit. Oh, I guess they're both the same. All right, we'll do we'll do a daze smash attack. They saved against it, but they also took some damage, which is good. Hamstring shot at Shadowheart. Wow, this is really going badly. We can do a sneak attack. I guess I'm still hidden. Hard to tell, to be honest. Uh, that was not as much damage as I was hoping for. In fact, it almost, like, I, there's still very much a problem right now. Can we... bonus action... I'm wondering, I'm wondering if it can give a healing potion to, uh, to Tav. I can shove this guy. Athletics failed. That's fine. Yo, he's attacking Tav while they're dying? Oh my god. 
Wow, everyone is taking some major damage right now. A member of your adventuring party has died. Use a scroll of Revivify. Wow, that was that was quick. Um, we do have a a, a scroll of Revivify. We're gonna choose um this location. Acolyte, fate must wait. Shadowheart is inspired. Use it to try again when you fail a roll. Uh, we're gonna shove this guy, hopefully. Nope, we still failed that. I just wanted to, like, break away. Now she's dying. <laughs> can we, can we give a heal? I, I wanted to see if I clicked it, if it would offer the option, but it looks like we can't do that. I just, I'm gonna try and kill this guy. I don't know. So it's an action to try and help uh, a party member up. Oof. Oh my god. Oh my god. These guys do not play around. Um. Release a wave of thunderous force that pushes away all creatures and objects. Mage hand. Grease. I feel like I should help up someone. Probably uh, Shadowheart. Good. They missed their attack of opportunity. So it doesn't work like normal D&D. Um, we like don't... They get to come back up like right away. Uh, generally speaking in D&D, you, you have to like wait a whole turn. See if we can't shove this guy away. There we go. Hoping that the statue offers some protection against that uh, archer. We're going to heal. And um, we don't have a ranged weapon, I guess. Shoot. And I guess I don't have an action. Your primary resource recharge once per turn. Oh, there's a party view. I didn't know that. Okay, cool. Um, we don't have any action points to help uh, Asterion. Okay, so yeah, I mean, this is pretty bad. I'm just going to run for now. Just so that she doesn't just get downed again. Um, let's do a oh, gimbal gimbal bach is level two. We should have really leveled up before coming here Let's do a guiding bolt on gimbal bach Nice good hit Um, don't have a lot of movement. We do have a healing potion though Oh entangled oops Okay, they're gonna make their way over here. Hopefully, Asterion... Okay, it was successful. They're dashing. That's good. They, they have to waste a turn to come over here. Um, Gale. Let's see. Gale can help up Asterion. Sucks we gotta keep using our actions to help up our party members, but, like, if we don't, then... We're seriously hosed. <laughs> I don't know why I like shoving uh, them away, but it, it's it's quite nice. The number and level of spell slots the arcane recovery action can restore. You cannot restore spell slots above fifth level. Oh, Gale is a wizard. I've never really played around with wizards. Okay, can we do a sacred flame on Gimbalbach? Nice. Fantastic. Uh, we don't have any more level one spells. 
which is a darn shame and there's two more heading this way we could switch to our ranged can we get out of this just gonna join um gale over here is there anything we can do that is like useful can we ready an action i'll switch to our ranged and see if I can't ready in action somehow. Uh, do, do, do cantrips. Blade ward. Oh, you know what? Blade ward wouldn't be a bad idea. Let's do that. I don't see any ability to ready an action. Um, we'll use it on herself. Flee combat. So they still have to dash over. That's really good. They have to waste two turns to, to come over here. Um, we're not hidden. We'll use a healing potion. And I don't have any action, so that's all I can do for now. Oh no. Okay, they missed Tav. This is good. Okay, I have two level one slot spell slots. Um, Firebolt is an evocation, like a cantrip. So that'll be one to ten damage. We could do Ray of Frost, which is an also a um, cantrip. Um, this is a level one spell. Level one spell. Sleep is a level one spell. Let's do a Firebolt. Disadvantage. Why are we at disadvantage? Just curious. I'm just I, I'm just trying things out. I don't know. Uh, maybe they, it's because they're dashing. I don't. That's not a really. That's not a rule or anything. But well, we managed to hit them with the firebolt. Um, two to seven damage. Kind of just want to like hit them with a firebolt. I like that you can just select the attack and then the enemy, and you don't have to like dicker around with movement. It does it for you. Okay. Um, we'll do a sacred flame. 45% We got it for three damage Piercing strike on gale ouch, but we got an attack of opportunity and it landed Um, we do have a short bow Can do a ranged attack or just a firebolt apparently we can do that as a rogue We missed. I didn't mean to do that movement. It tells me that we're on blood. I wonder if there's a um, some kind of effect for that. Like if it... Ouch. Oh god, Tav's almost dead again. Everyone's doing Firebolt. Cool, that's, that's a kill. So there's just the one left. What is this effect? Oh, con concentration shield of fate. Um, I'll let Tav heal himself. Fifty percent off only, or fifty percent off? Grant another creature advantage on stealth checks. Um, eh, just do sacred flame. Nice. I don't know why I keep trying to keep going into the vines. Take another healing potion. And, um... Do a sacred flame, I guess. I, I, I just like the sacred flame. Even though I hated it in Solasta. Not enough movement. 
Um, we're gonna hide. Did I fail my check? Lost condition hiding. Oh, I guess I did it right in front of them, didn't I? Oops. Oh, that's wild. Tav is down. Um, we're going to do a long rest soon, so let's do a witch bolt. Not enough movement. Can we not hit them at all? Is witch bolt touch? I thought it was ranged. Link yourself to a target with a bolt of lightning deal damage. Okay, well then, uh, how about a thunder wave? Target is blocked. Not sure. Can we like go here and try this? Do we have mage armor? Uh, I guess we don't have the range. Can we do a firebolt though? Okay. Well, I tried to do something that wasn't just firebolt and sacred flame again. Character has escaped death in a stable but unconscious. They will wake when they regain hit points. Take a short rest, heal them, or use the help action. That was a pretty brutal combat. All right, let's do a long rest. We'll level up. Unless I don't have to level up. Can I just do it from, from this menu? Oh God. I'm so used to Solasta making me do a long rest to level up. I mean, it makes sense, but uh, sometimes, you know, it's not fun even if it makes sense. So we got a level one spell slot. We got channel divinity. Um, turn undead, classic. Preserve life, evoke a healing energy that restores your allies. Um, okay, hit points. Passive feature automatically attack. Okay. Except. I don't think we get anything cool at level two. Shadow Heart also gets those things. Invoke Duplicity. Distract your enemies with an illusion within three meters of the illusion. Attack rolls have advantage for you and your allies. Cool. Asterion. I mean, it's just kind of fun to have a wizard for a little while. Cunning action. Oh, this is this is our rogue. Um, hide from enemies by succeeding stealth checks. Stick to so um, basically hide becomes a bonus action, so we can attempt to do that for free, as, along with disengage. These are really good things as a rogue. And lastly, Gale, our wizard. Chosen subclass. Something happened there. <clears throat> Hit points becomes 14. Uh, we got a spell slot, Evocation Savant. Learning Evocation spells from scrolls costs half as much, becoming 25 gold pieces per spell slot. Kind of wouldn't mind having a wizard in our team. Sculpt spells. Create pockets of safety within your Evocation spells. Allies automatically succeed their saving throws against these spells and take no damage from them. Gained two spells. Choices pending. Where where are these choices pending? Oh, I guess I, I have to pick spells. Could take burning hands, chromatic orb, uh, possibly create a surface on impact, alternatively choose a different type of damage. Magic missile. I mean, you gotta take magic missile. Classic spell. And um, long strider, enhanced leap. Ice knife. Uh, well, this is really cool because it's like area of effect. Ranged area of effect seems really powerful. Protection from good and evil always seems good. And then I always try to make use of it. And it, it just never really does much. Expeditious retreat. Ray of sickness. Tap. 
Hash's hideous laughter is good. Must have an intelligence of five or more. The target can try to shake off the effect each time it takes damage. Leave a creature pl prone with laughter without the ability to get up. Let's take that. We got a, a decent debuff and a decent attack. And we'll still do a, a long rest so we get our spells back. You have enough camp supplies to restore our hit points and spell slots if you long rest. So this is new to me, is uh, camping. At your camp, you take a long rest and fully heal your party. You can also manage party members, advance relationships with your companions, store items, and eventually change your character and recruit more followers. We can talk to Gail. Go to hell. Was there anything in particular I did to deserve such a greeting? You sound a tad more dejected than when we first met. Merely contemplating. Devils, dragons, mind flayers. They used to be abstracts. Pictures on a piece of paper. What a difference a day makes. Now we have tadpoles slithering through our heads like carnivorous feti. That's not abstract. Um, what can I say but that you're right? We're in deep, you know what? Quite well, mate. I see. I'll wake you bright and early. We'll need to find a healer before the wee one gets hungry. Something's on my mind. Your magician seems dour tonight. Must not relish the idea of sprouting tentacles. Understandable. Can't say I'm a fan either. It's just hard to join in when all of this feels so new. The night normally means bustling streets, bursting taverns. Curling up in the dirt and resting is, um, a little novel. Um, give it a try. We'll need to be fresh tomorrow. To rest yet. Today has been a lot. I need some time to think things through. To process this. You sleep. I'll keep watch. We'll both stay up. I'm not ready to pack uh turn my back on a stranger. <laughs> you know, if you want to spend time with me, you only have to say so. But suit you so. I'm sure we'll drift off at some point. Pretty sure, I think that their origin said they were like a vampire or something. They have some kind of vampiric curse. Doing the rounds, are you? You'd better get some rest. What were you two talking about? What do you mean? You and Gail. Uh, we were just discussing the next steps. I be careful with Gale. You don't trust Gale? He's a wizard. All they care about is power. Let's hope we rapidly find a healer. You seem reliable. I think you know how important it is that we find someone who can cure us. Best if we focus on that. Agreed. The sooner we find someone to help us, the better. Good. We might even get lucky and find one right away. As I see it, we're overdue some good fortune. Rest well. Oh, good, some mugwort. Salts of the mugwort. Okay. Well, we can um, cook some food. Auto, I'll just auto select it. 
I do appreciate how much depth this part is. the tadpole out of your mind think of home instead wisdom the tadpole influences you perhaps you might influence it in return nice Wizards, clerics, paladins, and druids can change their prepared spells at any time outside of combat. Really? I thought they had a long rest to do that. Cleric, uh, the only thing I don't have is create or destroy water, bane, shield of faith. I'm good not having those. I have bless. Gain 1d4 bonus to attack rolls and saving throws. Um... Common reactions. Okay, we're good there. Oh, alchemy. Can I make anything? I can make a sus myrrh grass suspension. Muffled pulses of sound. Dubs, dubs of thoughts belonging to those nearby. Interesting. Okay. Extract all ingredients. Potion of mind something? Mind reading. We needed mergrass or suspension of mergrass and any supplement. Divinity was a uh, pretty pretty robust for its like um, crafting. So I expect crafting to be a, a you know quite a big thing. It sure will. Um, let's see. Is there anything I don't want here? Shield of Faith is fine. Sanctuary is nice. I think I'm okay with these. Asterion, um... Weird that Asterion has a cantrip. I'm not sure I understand that one. Toggle non-lethal attacks. And Gale. What can Gale take? Fog Cloud? Cloud blinds and heavily obscures creatures within it. Magic missile. Oh, we should take magic missile. Let's take, um, we'll, we'll, um, mage armor is nice. We'll forgo grease and take, uh, made, uh, magic missile. Um, and kind of feel like I should take Tasha's hideous laughter. Protect the target from attacks. Increase its armor class to 13 plus its dexterity modifier. I appreciate that it's 13 plus its dexterity modifier and not just 16. Because 16 can be very limiting. Um, I think I'm going to forgo that and take Tasha's hideous laughter though. Learn more spells. Detect thoughts. And uh, we don't, we can't learn that yet. Insufficient level. Okay, so we're good now. We can uh, leave. But I think that we'll probably do it for this next episode. We didn't really accomplish too much, but we did do a combat. And we have the beginnings of our first dungeon 
quotation marks. Ooh, scale mail is quite nice. Uh, I'm sure someone can take a long sword. Saved twisting vines. Um, we'll have Shadow Heart lead from now on. I didn't mean to do that. Of course I am. My God has granted me a great blessing. Rude. Let me know. There's a matter I'd like to seek advice on from the master. Okay. Um, I can give this to someone. I'm kind of interested if anyone can use that. Not proficient. Okay, she was the only one that I would have maybe thought had a chance. Tamon. Tamon has trap disarm toolkit. Send that to uh, Tav. Um, send this to someone else. Actually, I'm going to pick it up. I'm going to send it to Tav. We have some gold. Studded shield might be nice for someone. Leather armor is quite good. Lots to loot right now. We have a dagger. I don't know if anyone can use make use of a dagger except for maybe Asterion, and I have to assume he already has something better. He already has a dagger. He could have a second one. I don't know if he can dual wield. What's his uh, armor right now? Padded armor, so it's already as good as like leather. So he can he can do offhand attack. He will automatically use your bonus. At action to make an offhand attack while using two weapons unless you toggle this option okay that's kind of cool we still have things to loot and then i'll end the episode oh no twisting vines <laughs> simple robe Talus divin divination without magic. Quarter staff. Anyone else that I haven't looted yet? Seems to me there was someone else. But I can't remember. Oh, we everyone stepped in acid like an idiot. Okay. Um. Ooh, okay, there's one more thing to loot. They're, they're uh, backpacks. Rope. I'll definitely take rope. More thieves tools. I'll take those only because uh, when I get new party members, I'm going to want them to have thieves tools. Not like there's no reason for that other than like when um, I'm still in Solasta mode. You'll have to forgive me, but... Uh, like, if someone tries to open a chest and fails, I would prefer everyone be able to attempt and have the tools to be able to attempt and not have to juggle tools, if that makes sense. I just had to do all of this in Solasta, and I did not enjoy it there. So, um, I'm going to grab this dragon egg mushroom. What is it? Dragon egg mushroom, exactly what I said. Seemed too strange. And uh, we'll start here on, on the next episode. If you are enjoying this series, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.